Welcome back to my channel, Crypto Earnings 101, where I show you how to make extra crypto online. So if you enjoy the content, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate this. So today's video, I'm going to be going over a platform called Wombat. I'm going to be unboxing some chests to show you what kind of NFTs you can, you can win and what kind of rewards you expect from it. I'm also going to be covering a game called Upland and how you can earn from playing this. Okay, let's get started. Log into my account now. If you aren't familiar with this platform, it's a gaming platform where you get paid just for playing games. You can see they have a whole list of games in their catalog, some desktop games, some mobile apps, but it is a really, really good platform and there's so many ways to earn. It started as OnePlay, as you can see here. It started as OnePlay in 2019 and it's evolved into a gaming platform called Wombat. The app uh, is called Wombat, home of NFT, and you can download that and you can actually earn more than just playing on the browser. Uh, but I'm just on my PC, so I'm just showing you the browser. You can see that I have 552,000 Wombox. Wombox is an in-game uh, currency that you get paid for when you start playing games. You can then convert this to crypto by joining the, the weekly pool and it shows you your estimated share of what you, you might get on payday, which is every Friday. But bear in mind, this is a pool, so as you join, your earnings will probably go down because more people will keep adding their warm box. So if you were to join this, join it in the last hour. So that's what you're probably going to get. Uh, so that's what I've learned from doing it. But today I'm not going to be joining or talking about the pool. I'm going to be talking about chests. At the bottom you have a silver chest. This is available for everyone. It's free to open and you can do this on a daily basis. Uh, you can get over 1,000 one box, which is always quite nice. Uh, you also get a completely daily task in the scroll so you can knock off that quite easily. 100 one box, easy to do. The golden chest uh, costs 50,000 one box, but it can contain crypto, one box, uh, and NFTs. So it looks like I've got an NFT for the game uh, Real Nation. You can sell that, but I'll show you later on how to do that. This is a Prime box. This is available for Prime users and anyone that has staked um, Wombat and is VIP level 5 or over. I'll go over that later as well. So you get NFTs from here and it's actually, you actually make quite a lot of money from this um, on a daily basis. Uh, and I'll show you how that is. I'm logged into my Atomic Hub on the EOS chain. Uh, you can see my account is here. I've got 35 EOS, which is at the current market price, about $26. Uh, I haven't put in any, I've never deposited any money into this. And this is just from selling NFTs that I've opened up on a daily basis. So as you can see, it can be quite profitable as long term. So you can see the two NFTs that I've just uh, received from opening the chest. Really easy to sell it. To go to that, you just click on the wee three dots and click on inventory and it'll take you to the screen where it show, shows you where all your NFTs are. So you click on list on market and you've got two boxes. You've got suggested price and you've got the lowest market listing. I always go by what the lowest market listing is because you want, personally, I like a quick sale. So I usually just, for a quick sale, I just put it just below. So 0 0.99, where it still receives me, I still re receive 74 cents. 
for opening a loot box every day. It's not bad. So you click on create and then in the browser you have um, that's up here uh, you got your Wombat extension all you have to do is uh, accept and confirm the transaction and it will be uh, listed. Uh, this is another one that I received so you can see the market price lowest market price is for 60 cents but the suggested is for 15 so I'm just going to say 0 0.78 and if it, does, if it doesn't sell if the marketplace for the lowest market listing goes down I'll just keep dropping that until someone buys it. At the end of the day it's all free earning uh, for uh, for earning your one bucks. So I talked about how to uh, open in the loot box and to, to, to get that you need to be different VIP levels. So I'm going to go over to the Wombat staking side of things. I'm going to show you what kind of level and what kind of benefits you get from this. You can see that I have 209,000 uh, Wombat staked on Polygon. It's two different chains. There's one for Wax, one for Polygon. I prefer Polygon because I like the Coinmatic and it's cheap uh, to, for the fees. So I'm VIP5 because I have over 200,000 staked. Uh, I stake it for one year. This gives me 15% APR on my tokens. So if I click on this one, you can see that I've received over 10,000 rewards, 10,000 Wombat in rewards just for having this staked and I can claim 893 tokens right now. Uh, I'm not going to do it today, uh, I will cover that in a later video, uh, but if I was to go to the current price and just on, on this stake alone, 10,000 10, Wombat is $30 in rewards can't really complain at that at all. So you can see the current price is 0 0.003. It has jumped up massively uh, in the last day. I don't actually know why. I, I don't know if there's been adoption of it or if there's been an announcement. Uh, I need to look into that. But you can see that in the last 24 hours it's gone up 61%. And in the last 90 days, it's gone up 86%. That's a, a very, very good uh, number for when you come to investing. And I'm quite happy with uh, the way that the market price is going. But when it does come to investing, you make sure that you do your own research and only, af only invest what you can afford to lose number one rule. Right, so the stake inside of things, this is the, the chart here for it. So staking 1000 Wombat would get you VIP level one, would get you 10% Wombox boost. So the Wombox boost is earning on anything that, that you, any Wombox that you earn in one play or Wombat so if you earn 100 one bucks, you get a 10% boost on top of this. I like the VIP5. The, it gives you 150,000 one bucks boost and you get Prime included. This means that you can open up the Prime loot box and you can see how easy it is to make money that way. It is only 10,000 one, one bucks as well, which is not a lot to, to earn and I'll show you how to earn this. Dungeon Master is another game that's part of the Wombat ecosystem. Uh, being VIP 5 you get a season pass and packs. You don't need to play the game. Uh, it, does, it does involve a lot of investment to get quite high up and you can sell the passes and packs for some money. $20-$30 is every season. 
Uh, so it's, that's quite a good way to make money from that as well. So I'm going to jump over to uh, a game called Upland and show you how to earn from this. I'm logged into my account on Upland and when you first start the game you're classed as a visitor until you have a net worth of 10,000 Upix which is in-game currency. Use this to buy property, buy cars and grow your sort of grow your property empire from there. It is a, a massive game, it's, it's quite complex so when you get 10,000 you then become an uplander. You can then um, do your KYC and every seven days for if you log in consecutively you get a spark bonus which is this here. That is, it just happens to be them on my seventh day. You with the spark you can build structures on your property or you can actually uh, rent it out and get passive uh, upics from there. I, I personally rent it out because I, I like to grow my my properties so I just stake it and receive um, passive income that way. So we click on collect and you can see 0 0.01 spark has been added uh, if I show you my balance, it's up here. So I've got 2.54 available. Uh, I should actually get back to staking it because uh, I'm missing out on uh, hourly Upix. I do have tutorials in that, my Upland section. Uh, please do look at them because they, they explain quite a lot. So one of the ways that you can earn is by treasure hunting in Upland. You don't need to invest any money, so I highly recommend that you look at this video as it will show you how to hunt. This way you can actually build up your uh, Upex and then start to build a hunting web in whatever city you decide. I've chosen Santa Clara because it's really small, it's expensive but it's a really good place to hunt as it's a tier 2 city. So when, when you hunt you um, spend Upix on spawning chest and this is why doing this on a daily basis you will earn a load of one bucks. So if I go back to uh, one play, if I click on Upland you can see I've earned over two million one bucks which is pretty good. So show details and for every 10 Upix you spend you receive 25 one bucks. Uh, when you're buying property for every 10 uh, Upix you spend you receive two and a half. So it is slightly less when you're buying but you all spend a lot more uh, when you are buying. So I like to uh, start my, my web and try and improve it a little bit. So there's not much up in the north. Uh, there's an area around about here that I want to try and uh, plug, but a lot of the chests I get is mostly central. So I found one that I'm quite interested in. You can scroll in and you can click this button and it kind of gives you an area, kind of gives you the properties of the area you're in. So if I scroll down a bit, I think it's about 40,000. Yeah, this one here, 40,000 Upix. Uh, so it's kind of, it kind of plugs a little gap between some properties. So it always makes uh, it a little bit easier to hunt. The more properties you have, the more chess you can do, which means more profits. So you can see it's size 72, which is pretty decent and gives me 480 uh, Upix a month. You get 5% uh, fee when you're buying. This goes into the Upland um, ecosystem, so it kind of makes it a bit more sustainable. So if I click on buy, and you'll see that my balance will be uh, um, deducted. 
it says that I, I'm now the owner. And you can see there, 4,000 left. That still gives me plenty for continuing to, continue to hunt. So that's it there. It's plugged a little gap between this property and this property. So if I had a chest around here, then it means that it's going to be easier for me to hunt. One thing I forgot to mention was when you are hunting, you can go. The reason that you build a web is because it's free to send your explorer, which is this wee guy. It's free to send your explorer to your properties. So I can jump to this one and go send, and it will cost me nothing. If I was to send it to uh, this property here, let's go there, it would cost me 95, which you don't want to pay anyway. I would, I would never pay 95. Uh, everything's explained in my hunting tutorial. So I'm going to wait about 30 minutes and then I will show you the earnings that I get from from Wombat just for buying property. I'll see you in a bit. Usually the Wombox get added between 30 minutes and 60 minutes after you spend them on Upland. So if I go to my account on Wombly, there you should get a notification after after you spend Upix. So you can see I've got 26,251 bucks. This is just from um, this is just from spending money on or spending upex on Upland, buying properties. You can probably get depending on what VIP you are, but you can get up to twenty thousand a day um, if you are just treasure hunting. Uh, I, I get between 15 and 20,000. I'm on VIP 5. If you're VIP 6, VIP 7, you get even more. Uh, it does involve a, a bit of a large sum of wombats, wombat to stake, but the option is there. So it is, this is quite profitable as you can see at 26,500. So you can then open up a chest and it can contain crypto. I have won 10, 25 dollars a few times. Uh, I have won an NFT that sold for 250 dollars. So it's all down to chance and um, being consistent as well is a big part of it. That's why I, I do play Upland on a daily basis. And I am trying to grow my empire up. As you can see, I have 12, 13, 13 properties now. And it's not anywhere where I want it to be. I've still got lots of gaps to, to plug, but it's expensive. So if you are wanting to invest and build a web in a city, please make sure that you do your research they're all, they're all different kinds of, they're all different tiers and cities. They just opened up Miami as well. So that's, a, that's another one to, uh, if you wanted to invest into. But yeah, if you are enjoying the content, again, please give it a thumbs up and have a look at my Upland videos as they will really, really help you. I have payment proof for Wombat as well and a tutorial on how to play Wombat. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you in the next one.